Did you know there are around 200 new AI tools that are launched every week? If you're only using ChatGPT, you are so limited by the possibilities that AI can offer. Today, we are going to try out the newest and coolest AI tools that have just been launched. Plus, we handpicked the ones that are free, so you can go ahead and try these without any upfront cost. Let's dive right in. All right, this tool is pretty useful. It's called Either Choice. If you're stuck on deciding between two things, this makes it super easy to compare and contrast and help you make a decision. So let's test it out. So for example, let's say Walmart versus Target. Target for sure. Interesting. <laughs> Walmart is disorganized and cluttered. Very interesting. And of course, do your due diligence. Make sure to fact check everything instead of believing what it says, but yeah, it gives you a nice table breaking down the pros and cons of each platform. So let's test out another one. Elon Musk versus Mark Zuck. Interesting. So yeah, it gives you a detailed breakdown of each of these points and who's the winner of each of these factors. So there you have it. This tool is completely free. It's called Either Choice. All right, next tool is called Enka.fm, and this is an AI tour guide where you can use Google Maps to find a location and then ask it questions about that destination. So let's give it a try. So you can see we can search anywhere in the world using Google Maps. Let's say we want to find more info about Singapore Botanic Gardens and see what it gives us. Cool, so it gives us some info. Let's ask it some questions. Nice, let's try something else. What's the least busiest day or time to visit? Very nice. Are there admission fees? Okay, so there you go. You can see it's, it's pretty accurate, so yeah, this tool again is called Inca.fm. All right, the next tool is called Word Wield Article Writer. This is a free blog post writer using AI, and you can use GPT 3.5 or GPT 4. You will need to enter in your own API key from OpenAI, so let's grab that real quick. Okay, so I've created a new secret key. I'll paste that in here and then target keyword. Let's say we want to write about AI for healthcare. Additional keywords, let's leave that blank for now. And you can choose different writing styles. Let's just keep it at formal, authoritative, informative. First person, number of sections, five. Let's just keep everything at default and see what it gives us. So you can see this is a lot more streamlined than using this directly in ChatGPT because ChatGPT, the output isn't this long, especially for the free version. So you'll need to prompt it multiple times, like write an introduction, and then after it finishes, you need to prompt it again, write a body paragraph, etc, etc. But this just does it all in one go, and it's completely free. So. It's a decent blog. It doesn't have any references, so I would actually couple this with perplexity.ai, which I'll show you real quick. This is another free tool where you can 
find references online. So you can see super quick and it pulls up all these different links that are like scientific articles or other trustworthy references that you can inject into your blog. But yeah, this is a super helpful tool. It's completely free. It's called Word Wield. Plus you can download the Markdown version or the HTML version. Super easy and straightforward for writing blogs. All right, I really like this next tool. It's called Chord Variations, and this uses AI to generate chord progressions for you. So you can input it a list of different chords you would like to be part of the song. So we'll, we'll just keep everything at default, but you can like add more to these. So for example, if you wanna add, I don't know, F major, you can add that to the number of chords in your song, but let's just remove that and keep it with the default. So the default is G, E minor, C, and D. So let's play this and see what we get first. So yeah, a very basic set of chords, right? And we can click generate and it can give us more ideas on how we can spice this up. So here's one variation. So instead of E minor, it's giving us an E7. Let's see what this sounds like. Yeah, I can see this is, this does sound a bit jazzy and funky. So very cool. Next one, we can add in an A7. So let's see what that sounds like. interesting and this is great for music theory as well especially like for me I'm not really familiar with all these sevens and diminished and all all those fancy terms so I think this is a very good learning platform for me let's try this one out huh, very interesting let's try this last one Yeah, you can definitely have a lot of fun with this and it can generate a lot of ideas for you for songs. So again, this is called Chord Variations. All right, so next up is Formzill. This uses AI to generate any document you want. So let's give it a go. Let's say resume for, how about marketing consultant? Let's see what it gives us. Here we go. Here's a decent resume that's completely made up. And you can also click on the document to edit. So instead of five years, you can say like eight years. So yeah, pretty quick and easy. There's also more options you can choose from, uh, from simple default to detailed. Let's just stick with default and let's try something else. Let's say, let's try contract for software developer intern very nice yeah it gives you a, a very nice template that you can use and fill in your own info and it's it's pretty decent it has all the standard clauses like non-disclosure ownership yeah this is very nice and you can save it to a pdf or print this out so and of course you can edit this so on this 20th day of July you can edit all of this out right and then after you're done you can print it out or save it to a PDF so very convenient and straightforward again this tool is called Formzill all right here's the next tool it's called simpleblog.ai this is a free blog title and headline generator and if you look at the Q&A you can see that it also incorporates SEO factors which is great for increasing your blog and websites ranking on Google Let's try this out. Choose a topic to get blog post ideas about. So let's say AI for healthcare and see what it gives us. And there you go. It's pretty simple. I'm sure you can also do this in ChatGPT. 
but it is what it is. This is a completely free tool. Feel free to try it out. All right, so the next tool is called ChatGPT Prompt Generator. This tool helps us create a polished prompt to input to ChatGPT to give us a better result. Because I think for a lot of us, we don't really know how to create the best prompt to input to ChatGPT. And I think this tool can help us automate that. And it gives us a cheat sheet for reference as well. So let's say you want it to act as any one of these roles. You want it to create this task in this format. It can help you do that. So let's try this out. Let's say I want ChatGPT to be a marketer. The task is to write a blog post on, let's say, AI in health care. And the format, we can just have it as rich text. Okay, so copy this prompt. And we go to ChatGPT. And there you have it. It's pretty simple. I mean, it's kind of appending these three things into a simple prompt, but it's a it's a good framework for you to use to improve your prompts further and get better results in ChatGPT. All right, the next tool is called BotTell. This is a chatbot for parenting advice. And you simply enter your question here and you select either quick and short or long and detailed. So let's try it out. Let's type in a question. How do I stop my two boys from fighting? All right, so there you go. Pretty clear and concise steps on how you can resolve this issue. I'm sure you can also ask ChatGPT this question and it can give you a similar result, but I think this bot is more specialized and trained to provide parenting advice. So there you go. This tool is called BotTell. And that is all. If you enjoyed this video, remember to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos on AI tools. Also, we built out a website where you can search thousands of AI tools for whatever your needs. It's the most complete AI tools directory out there. Check it out at ai-search.io.